in the quaint village of Elderia, nestled between rolling hills and lush meadows, lived a young woman named Elara. Elara was unlike anyone else in the village. While the villagers were content with their simple lives, she had a burning desire to create something extraordinary. From a young age, Alara's mind was brimming with ideas and dreams that extended beyond the horizon of her village. Elderia was known for its beautiful cottages and thriving farmlands. The villagers had a tradition of passing down their homes and lands through generations. Following the footsteps of their ancestors, Alara's family was no different. But her heart was set on charting her own path. She often spent her days sketching intricate designs and imagining grand structures that would reshape the very landscape she loved. One day, a famous architect named Master Cedric visited Elderia. He was renowned for his awe-inspiring creations that graced cities far and wide. The village buzzed with excitement as Master Cedric admired the cottages and cobblestone streets. Elara, bold and driven, mustered the courage to approach him. Master Cedric, she said, her eyes sparkling with determination. I have an idea that could change the future of our village. A bridge that would connect our village to the neighboring town. Saving travelers days of journey. It would be a testament to our unity and a symbol of progress. Master Cedric chuckled kindly, patting her head. Ah, young dreamer, your enthusiasm is commendable. But building a bridge is no simple task. It requires resources, time, and the approval of the villagers. Undeterred, Elara persisted. I understand, sir. But isn't the best way to predict the future to create it? I believe in this vision. And I am willing to work hard to make it a reality. Amused by her spirit, Master Cedric decided to give her a chance. He provided her with guidance. Teaching her about architecture, engineering, and the art of convincing others. Elara absorbed his teachings like a sponge. Her determination fueling her voracious appetite for knowledge. She started sharing her dream with the villagers. Initially, they were skeptical. The tradition of their ancestors had become a security blanket. And change was met with resistance. However, Alara's unwavering belief in her ability to convey her vision began to sway hearts. With each passing day, more villagers joined her cause. Contributing materials, time, and effort. As the bridge slowly took shape, Elara faced numerous challenges. The weather was unpredictable, resources were limited, and there were moments of doubt. But her mantra remained the best way to predict the future is to create it. She refused to be deterred by setbacks, seeing them as stepping stones toward her ultimate goal. Months turned into years. And finally, the day arrived when the bridge was complete. It was a magnificent marvel, spanning the river that had once separated Elderia from the neighboring town. The villagers gathered for the grand inauguration. Their faces a mix of pride and awe. Master Cedric stood beside Elara, a proud mentor. The bridge not only connected the two towns physically but also bridged the gap between tradition and progress. It became a symbol of the power of vision, determination, and the willingness to embrace change. Elderia flourished as trade increased. Relationships were strengthened, and new opportunities emerged. Years later, as Elara stood on the bridge, overlooking the bustling village she had helped shape, Master Cedric approached her. You have proven that a single idea Fueled by unwavering determination, can shape the future, he said. Elara smiled, her eyes reflecting a journey of challenges and triumphs. Indeed, Master Cedric, the best way to predict the future is to create it. And in that moment, Elara realized that the bridge she had built was not just of bricks and mortar, but of courage, resilience, and the belief that one person's vision could transform an entire community's destiny.